A double gendered being. And this goes also for the men. You're men, but you're the bride of Christ. You're women, yet you're sons of God. So I want to bring to you who a first lady is in a few minutes. A female minister, a first lady, is a humble support. Not just any kind of support, but a humble support to the senior pastor, to her husband, to the minister set for her to follow and submit under. You are to be a support with your skill set, with your capabilities, with your giftings, with your calling, but not just any kind of support, a humble support. Humility is often misinterpreted to be pitifulness. I don't see humility that way. Humility is knowing who you are, knowing your strengths, yet knowing where you belong. The man is at the forefront and you are a support. You are a fortress to back up that mandate and the call upon his life. A humble support. You do this with skill set, gifts, capabilities, personality. At every point in time, you are dynamic. At every point in time, you are observant. At every point in time, you are flexible to know times and seasons in Zion. You are a careful watcher of your husband. And you are to be a support depending on what you're meant to be in that moment. That means that there are times and seasons in the man of God's life where he will come to the congregation, to the flock, kind and gentle. And here's the surprise. In those times, you come in firm and sure. There are times he comes firm and strong. You come in soft and gentle. It is the delicate balance between father and mother that you maintain for your spiritual children. 